Babe, I love you. You're my favorite person. I got the dudes, I got the loot, I got the mmm, I got the sauce, I got the mmm. Damn. <laughs> What's going on, guys? Hi. 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 How are you? How are you guys doing? Good. We are uh, the morning show that works together and uh, quarantines together. <laughs> there you go. We don't mind spending well, all the time together. Got you. Got you. Got you. Where are you guys? Uh, where are you guys from? Uh, we're in Tampa. Oh, cool. 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 Um, what have you guys been up to during quarantine? Have you guys been doing a lot of radio shows and stuff? Oh yeah. We. <laughs> oh yeah. We do so much talking. It's a little real. I don't know if anybody wants to hear us anymore, but we do the show. We do a podcast every day, and then we just talk to each other. So, so you guys yeah. ever get sick of each other, or yeah, uh, yeah. Well, I'm just joking. Uh, well, so here's the awkward dynamic: is that Holly and I have worked together since 2008, and right. we lived together the first five years. And now she uh, she has that little girl. I had yeah. to see. I got pregnant, and he was like, "See you later. I'm gonna move out now." And I was like, "Okay." Yeah. So it's fine. Yeah. So now I'm, you know, me and my little baby, and then Scott Aww. joined the show, and now he lives with Miguel. Yeah. Aww. So you guys spend a family. lot of time together. <laughs> Like a lot of time, a lot of time, all the time, too much. Time. So, yeah. so, so, you know, obviously in life, it's good to have balance. Where do you guys find the balance to get space and do your own thing? Do you guys have that? <laughs> um, well, Holly, <laughs> you <laughs> No, I mean, That's Holly, it is. I mean, Holly is here now uh, because after this, we're going on to our Facebook page to uh, have a little happy hour with our listeners. And so, I mean, we really spend all of our time together, but that's what makes us such like a close knit circle is that we don't, I mean, we live together. So Scott may yeah. get sick of me sometimes. I, I can go hang out in my room and I just leave. Yeah. It's yeah. not that big though. That's no, a small not. space. Yeah. I need my yeah. time. It's probably good though. It's, it's, it, you know, there's probably their, the benefits, there's probably benefits in it too. Just be, having the social aspect and having each other to talk to. I'm sure that's, you know, probably good too. Right. For me, I think it has helped keep like quarantine pandemic kind of sane because yeah. like the, this is like normal for me. You know what I mean? So exactly. it's like it's it's OK. And so like for you, are you and obviously it's like you and Haley in the house. But yeah. do you have other people that are just in there with you like that help you guys out? And are you sick of them or how does that work for you? Um, that's a good question. Um, we have a chef, which was your super blessed, blessed uh, to have um, because I feel like that's a big uh, I feel like stressor food, just even the conversation with your significant other of what are we going to eat? I want this. You want that? Or usually it's just you choose, you make the decision. No, you choose. And so, mm -hmm. yeah. chef, you know, make yes. that decision helps us a lot. So mm. does the chef choose sometimes? Uh, no, no, that's what I mean. It, it helps having the chef to choose to make. Mm. Gotcha. Yeah. That's what I mean by that. So, so how does that work? Do, do like, at five o'clock, does he say, hey, we're having lamb tonight or we're having burgers tonight? How does that work? So um, it's Chef Kiki and she, it's a girl and she's the best. Um, and she uh, basically has, because um, I have a few dietary restrictions, I don't eat gluten and certain things like that. Mm -hmm. um, and then I try to do a certain amount of protein and stuff. So she kind of just follows a list. Oh, that's can nice. Up, can we get Chef Kiki? <laughs> Yeah, Did you uh, come to Tampa when you come? Man, next time? she's she's the best. We love her so much. Love that. Wait, I have a dumb question. Does does gluten does that involve Doritos? Is is that? Yeah. Uh, well, I believe probably it has gluten. Maybe in the. It usually says gluten free on the actual package. I don't believe D Doritos are gluten free. <laughs> I don't, yeah, think, I don't think, think so. Either. So, do you not eat Doritos? Do you? Um. I I would eat uh, I would eat Doritos if if it was a special day and I was you know out and there was nothing around. I'm not like so to the point where I don't make any exceptions. Okay, so real quick though, we have to know. 
are you like team cool ranch or are you team nacho cheese don't get yourself don't sorry because well we were having this debate before we talked to you because i just went grocery shopping okay. and i got nacho cheese and holly loves cool ranch so what do you yeah. like? i like cool ranch and i'm like yeah. i'm on the island all by myself so i think uh you i feel like if i was to eat doritos consistently i would be a I would be the original, I think it's nacho cheese. Is that what y yours are? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. But in, I don't know so if they you have guys have it, but in Canada, they have a flavor called Zesty. Ooh. What is that? Zesty Doritos. And it's like, they're not spicy, but they got like a tang to them. They're fire. But they're only in Canada. Yeah, I was going to say Zesty on the back, Doritos. all they have is like spicy, sweet chili, dynamite. What the heck? The, the sweet chili ones are good. Yeah, they are. Yeah, they are. The sweet mm. chili ones are fire. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. So I, well, I do have to ask before, because I know you, you have a lot going on today, is yeah. we were talking about when you, we were watching the earlier interviews and when you told Haley to get your cord and we were like, that echo in that house, how long does it take for you to like run to your room and back to where you are now? It's not, I think it's just a high, it's just high ceilings. That's why it's actually not uh, very okay. far. She's in, She's in the bedroom right through that door there. Oh, Ooh, I, okay. love the, I love that wall. It's a good, it's a good wall. The Thank brick. you. This yeah. is my, this is my living room kitchen area. Oh, we, we don't have any uh, TV in here because we like to, I don't know, not have a TV <laughs> in this area, but we have a little, little TV in the kitchen. Okay. Wait, okay. so when you're all hanging out in the living room, like, are, what do you, are y'all not watching TV or what are you doing? So when we're in the living room, we uh, like to play games, uh, like board games, word games, and put on a fire. And then if Lord we want to go, I obviously we have a movie theater room downstairs. So if we want to go to watch a movie, we just go. That's oh. where you watch them. Yeah, that's where you watch it. Like when you were watching, like, uh, I don't know, like Tiger King or something, you're in the movie yeah, room we, and the tigers are like. Exactly. Yeah. 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 yeah it's fun. Oh, but, the tiger hey. is best though. I gotta keep moving on with some more people, yeah. but it was so nice and, and really enjoyable talking to you three. And I uh, hope to, to see you guys soon. Tampa, Absolutely. Right? Tampa? We can't wait. Tampa, yep. We can't wait yes, to see you in Tampa. Uh, can't wait to see you guys in Tampa. Okay. All righty. Have a good weekend. Bye. Bye, guys. Take care. There we go. There you Hi. are. I'm so sorry for all the inconvenience. Hey. hey, it's all good. I haven't seen you in a while, so it's good to see you from afar. How are it's, you? It's good to see you too. Um, good. How's your how's how's the family? How's everybody? Good. Going? Everybody's good. good. We're just bored. How, How are you guys? We're good. How many people you got in the house right now? Um, so me, my husband, my son, and my dog. This is hey. Richard. Aww. Say hi to Justin. So he's I just I can't decide if he loves that we're home or if he's just like, get out of my space. Yeah. So, Aww, yeah, where's your dog? Boy. What kind of dog is it? So we rescued him, so we're not sure, but we think he's a, a Rhodesian Ridgeback mixed with like lab pit. Definitely a little bit of Rhodesian rich bag. I definitely see that. Yeah, he is but the best animal beautiful, ever. Beautiful. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, our, our dog is hiding in shame because Haley gave it the worst haircut of life. I saw that picture and it didn't look that bad. What was wrong it's with it? It's because she, we put a coat on it. It's like she tried to buzz it, but she used my face clippers. Okay. And basically it just has a bunch of bald spots. It's just not, it's not, it's not good. Oh, yeah, well, I need but, a haircut too, so she can do mine. Yeah, I don't know. You, by the, by the looks of the dog, you would not want to get your hair cut by. Okay. Um, so you've been, you've been in quarantine. You're with your family. Do you guys do any board games? Do you guys like doing things as a family? What have you guys been doing as a family? 
We've been watching Disney Plus. So like my son is like just able to watch TV now. So like we've been binging like movies and stuff basically. And we did like a late, I should have brought it in here. We did a um like Lego Ferrari thing the other day. And it's like a billion pieces, which is not my thing doing Legos yeah. like that. So that took like 10 hours. Dang. Yeah. He's, not he, he's, he's, not, he's not impressed. He's not impressed by. He's not impressed by this. No, nah, but. Um, <laughs> Legos, man. I haven't played with Legos since I was a kid. So you had to, you had to like, you had to like get the thing and put them all together and like follow the instructions and do that whole thing. Like it's so many pieces that like they bag it up and like here's section one, two, three, four. Like it was, I basically watched while they did it, but it's Dang. yeah, it's That's wild. Awesome. What yeah. kind of what I'm kind of mom? To... What other mom stuff have you been doing? Like walking around the neighborhood. That's about it. That's walking awesome. coloring yeah just coloring. doing whatever more legos how old are your you have how many how many kids just one just, just one. one he's almost two so he like watches disney jr and like you oh. know cute little shows like that what's so. his favorite what's his favorite thing to watch uh mickey and the R mickey's they just changed the name but it's like mickey and he like races cars and stuff oh his so Mick, mickey's mixed up adventures i think is what it's called so they have so We're, many he, mickey shows it's crazy. They're, yeah, they're so good. But he will sing intentions and like ask for it already. And he's not even two, which is crazy. So thank you for that music. Absolutely. Well, I, I appreciate you guys playing yeah. it. And um, it was it was an it was an enjoyable, fun time talking to you. Yeah, good to see you again. Okay, good to see you. Talk to you later. Bye. Bye, Justin. Take care. Ooh. Found you guys. Found Pop Crush. Hi, Justin. Hello. How are you? How are you? Good. Are you? I'm Kayla from Pop Crush. I'm Justin. Have we met before? No, we haven't. I always well, have, I have to ask because to in the past I've met so many people and I, really? I tend to forget <laughs> sometimes. So I'm sure you meet thousands and thousands of people all the time. Look, yeah. Milo wants to meet you. I saw the uh, the girl before me had a dog. I was wow. like, oh, my cat. His name's I know Milo? It's Milo. Oh, that's, that's such a cute name. Hi, How Milo. Is? He's unimpressed, he's too. He's doing. like, put me down, Mom. <laughs> he just woke up from a nap. That's why he's like, so cute. Me I now. love cats. Yeah, I have a couple cats in, in, in California. Um, really? And, uh, yeah, a friend of mine's watching them, but... I'm in Canada right now. Where you, where did you say you're located at right now? So I'm in Maryland right now, but okay. I work out of Jersey. I Got came you. back to Maryland to like quarantine with my family because I just didn't want to do it alone. Got so you. I'm here. I do the show from my closet and Ooh, yeah. that's about it. <laughs> that's what everyone seems to be doing because it's the best for sound, right? Yeah, because it's like if I do it anywhere else, it's like echoey. So I got. Or you got to put like a, a blanket of over top stuff. of you. You know what I mean? Yep. I'm, my microphone is in between pillows. And then my That's clothes awesome. like muffle the sound. It's perfect. <laughs> That's awesome. So you're being productive in this time. That's really awesome. Yeah. What What have you been doing? Uh, I've been actually making music. I've been recording some yeah. songs and making some music. Yeah. So it's it's been really it's been really productive as well on my end. So it's you know, I was thinking because before this, I was on uh, your cat's Instagram. Oh yeah. And I was like, you know, this is a perfect time for people to start fostering animals and Absolutely. so i was thinking about doing that with all this free time Haley was talking about that too she's like i really? wish we were in la i would foster an animal right now she's like i just What'd want to bottle feed i want to bottle feed a dog a baby dog oh. or a baby cat. <laughs> that's what me and my family are talking about it's like why not we have all this time and like people are more and more people are fostering you exactly. know animals now so yeah. yeah what have you what have you been uh what have you been watching on tv what i've been watching honestly any, any i've been show? watching honestly a lot of Instagram live stuff. So, awesome. uh, and you know those Instagram live battles that they've been doing. Have you seen Lil John and T? I heard of it. I heard of them, but I, I I haven't seen them yet. Are they pretty cool? You haven't seen any? No, nah, they're. Who cool. would you like to go head to head Ooh, in an Instagram battle? Who would you head. like to see? 
like who would I like to see, huh? I would like to see like Jay Z and Lil Wayne go head to head. That'll be tight. Oh, that would be perfect. Or Beyonce and Rihanna go head to head would be tight. That that would be a good one. That would be a Beyonce really good one. and Rihanna would be so tight. That I don't. I, you couldn't even choose between the two of them. It'd be too hard. They're too both so too hard. hard. Yeah. It's not even like it's a celebration of music. It's not like you're pitting yeah. them up against each other. It's exactly. just like everybody wins. It's all, everyone's good. exactly, exactly. If exactly. you could do an Instagram live battle, who do you think? If that I you could battle see? anyone, I just yeah, I wouldn't want to. I don't know. I wouldn't want to like go against anybody because it's 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 hard because like music isn't about like being better or worse than somebody mm -hmm. else's. It's about like. Celebrating People music. Celebrating, yeah, life and music yeah. and art and stuff. So I don't really think it should be a challenge. Right. I would love to see you and Chris Brown because yeah. you guys are both equally, like, amazing. Thank you. And I think Thank that would you. be dope. That would be cool. Yeah, I've always <laughs> looked up to him and his music, and I, I think he's, he's a great guy. Um, I also wanted to tell you that I so appreciate how you are, like, bringing your fans into a whole new uh, genre when it comes to, like, uh, gospel music. You yeah. know, I love how you have your church, you stream your, you know, church services live on Instagram. Yeah. You get on here and sing gospel music. And I just think that is like, especially in this time, Thank you. that is absolutely what people need. Thank you. Yeah, it's, it's what gets me through, you know, my journey in life. And so it's really important that I am honest with that. And, you know, sometimes it's hard to express your faith because you're afraid of what people will think. But mm -hmm. I think when you step out and you're just, being yourself and you say, this is what I believe and you don't have to believe what I believe, but this is what I believe and maybe it'll help you and maybe it doesn't, but just being honest with your journey, I think is yeah. important, I think. Yeah. And I think that's why people love you so much is because you like have been so transparent and so honest about that journey Thank and you're you. like bringing your fans along with you and it's amazing to see. And it Thank also you. invites other people to be like, oh, what is this, you know? Yeah, absolutely. So I think Thank that's you cool. for saying that. That means a lot. No problem. One last question, though. So you okay. know all these social media challenges? Yeah. Why hasn't Usher's Prodigy done the Climax Challenge yet? Damn. I, have, I was going to do it the <laughs> other day, and I just forgot. I should probably do it. We need it. I'm going to do it. I'll do it this week. Please do, because you would body it for sure. Thank you. Thank you for saying that. <laughs> I'm going to do that. All right. Well, it's nice to meet you, and I hope you it have a nice wonderful rest. It was nice to meet you, too. Day. Yeah. Pleasure. You, too. You're the best. Bye. Take care. Bert, I got you on here. You should be accepting it. Damn. My uh -oh, dude. Oh, there they are. My dude. What's up, fam? What are you doing, man? Long time no see. Dude, you know how like you made me feel so Hey old? bud. Hey. You made me feel so old last time we were on. The last time you saw this dude, he was five years old. Damn, no way. Yeah. Is this your son too? Yeah, this is my oldest son. Dang, how you been, man? I'm good. 
Good. It's good to see you again. How, how you been? Well, uh, yeah, how, 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 how old surreal. are you now? Uh, 17. Dang. You're old. Damn. And you were five last time I seen you? I think five or six at least. You were, you were in Nashville. You were in Nashville. We flew up just for the concert in Nashville, met Dang. you beforehand, said, hey, and then we flew back down just so we could meet Dang. you. That's awesome, man. It's good to see you again, bro. You too. How have you been? been? You guys been good? What have you guys been up to? You guys been hanging a lot? Yeah. Yeah. We haven't been doing a whole lot because, you know, the apocalypse is upon us. So <laughs> I know. Uh, you can call it that. That's for sure. It's been, it's been pretty crazy. I don't know. How are you crushing hours in the middle of the day, man? Like, I used to say that the days were super long and, I mean, super short, and now they're just super long. Like, what are you doing? Man, um, well, I try to... I've been trying to switch my sleeping schedule around and get up really early and work in the morning, work out early in the morning and um, record some music in the morning and then try to get to bed early. But it's just this whole quarantine has you just so mixed up. It's just hard yeah. to stick to any sort of schedule, you know? Yeah. He's getting, what, you get in bed like two in the morning now and getting up at like two in the afternoon. Yeah. 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 Haley's like that. Yeah. Haley's and just she she was just talking about she wants to she wants to get her, her schedule back, but I don't yeah. know, man. I wish I knew when when to back was, you know. How are you? How are you? Um, how are you working in this time? How are you doing your your radio show? So there's four people on the show, like you know. So we're all doing it from our our different houses. So it's kind of been a cluster, man. It's it's hard to do a show when you're not talking all over each other. It's been it, uh, we're doing the best we can, you know. And are you guys connecting? Is it like a? Is it? It's not live, right? It's pre-recorded. No, it's live. So who's? It's live. Yeah. How are you doing it? That seems um, great. So, so you can hear them talk live, and like it's the whole thing. It's like a Zoom call, man. Yeah, and it just goes out yeah. over all of our stations. Yeah, it's crazy. Do you find like you're talking over each other, or? So we do this thing where if anybody has anything to say, they just raise their hand, and then I choose, I choose them so we're not, like, all over each other. Ah. Uh, I know. Dang. It's just so complicated. Yeah. It is. So are you dang. getting up in the morning and working on stuff? Or are you getting up in the morning and just working out? Or what are you doing? Yeah, so I got up this morning. I did a workout with um, my trainer, Carlin, Dr. Carlin Coker. He's, uh, he's a trainer out of Greenwich, Connecticut. Yeah, and fancy. so he special he specializes in um, like just uh, basically just really he's a doctor, but he's also like a, a um, he's like a bodybuilder, you know. And so he he got Shaq back in shape when Shaq got hurt back in the day, and yeah. he came back and won a bunch of championships. He's like trains a lot of UFC fighters, and he's just like super like so passionate about what he does. So. I get up in the morning and he's like, this is the meat and potatoes nobody wants to do. And he's like pushing me to the max. So it's good, man. He's, he's good shit. Are you just trying to get all cut up just for the sake of getting cut up? Or is it, to, what, what's the intent? Well, I want to be funk, like my, my, with what I do, I need to be really explosive with performing. Cause you're like, you're here, you're at a toaster, right? And then you got to pop up, run to one side of the stage. One, I mean, it's a lot more cardio and physical stuff than people really realize. And dancing, yeah. you got a lot of body movement. So I got to be really explosive. And I, when this is all said and done, which I hope is sooner than later, I'm going to be back on tour. You know what I mean? So I want to be able to, um, you know, be in shape and not be a bum when I come out yeah. of this yeah. thing. Right. Are you and Haley, yeah. like, getting, like, are there little things that you're doing that she's annoyed by? Like, my girlfriend the other day told me that she didn't realize how loud I chewed crackers the other day. Oh, it's literally everything. I mean, it's Little everything. Thing. Both of us, it's like all these little things. Just, my breath stinks all the time. And like, like I just brushed my teeth. She's like, <laughs> I, I came out and eat a piece of chicken last night. She's like, you smell like chicken. I'm like, I ate chicken. What do you want from me, woman? <laughs> so things it's little like things that. that didn't bother you before, man, that are just like on your nerves. It's just building up, building up, building up, building up. So much time together spent, but... It's it's a good test to our relationship, and it's right. been really it's been really good. Hundred percent, man. Well, you look good, dude. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. You guys look good too. It's good seeing you, man. Be, be safe, be healthy. All right. Absolutely, guys. Hey, good good seeing you, bud. See you too. Take See care. Hi, right, guys. Bye.
I don't know which ones we got left, but. Damn. Cool. I'm going to do this. What's going on, brother? How we doing, my man? How are you, man? Have we uh, have we spoken on here before? No, sir. How, no, how, sir. How are you today, man? I'm well. I'm well. I just got done with a day of work. Made myself Good. a little quarantine meal. Good. Yeah. What are you What are you eating, dude? Fuck. Let me see what you got going on you, there. Uh, rice. Oh man, it it it, it, it froze. Sorry froze on us. Dang. Let's see. It's, it was spinning, wheel spinning. All right, let me see. There you Ooh. go. Nice. Oh, hold up. Nice, nice, pretty healthy meal How for, for quarantine. Did you cook, Should we... you cook it yourself? Yes, sir. Should we get a little, uh, little jam stuff going? Where are Maybe? you from? Sure. Detroit, Detroit. Where are you from? It's it's hard. Honestly, it's really hard to do jam sessions because of the latency, and you're you're really delayed. How about now? Unfortunately, but I, I I'd love to hear you play some if you want. How about uh? How about me and my roommate play a little something for you? I'd love to hear you and your roommate. My guy Justin something. Bieber. What's up, dudes? How are you, sir? <laughs> Here, wait. Let I'd me take the I'd love to hear out. you guys uh, riff on something if that's cool. You want to riff on something? Sure. Let's do it. No pressure. No pressure. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's hear it. It's my, my buddy, Justin. What, right, let's do it. <laughs> what kind of what music do you guys uh, play and make? You know, I'm not the mediocre kind. The mediocre kind, yeah. I try to keep uh, Bennett, Bennett's all over the board. Yeah. But uh, you, you yeah. guys enjoy it, though, right? It, it, it brings joy to your soul, so that's good. Exactly, exactly, always. Yeah, man. Hey, well, maybe if we get a beat going, you can do it. You can maybe sing over it. Okay. We're delayed in quarantine. We're delayed. Five. Five. 
Awesome. Well, en enjoy enjoy your time uh, in quarantine and keep making music. It's, it? uh, it's, yeah, it, it makes a lot of people happy. Cool. Good, good job, talk, man. Good, good, talk, man. good plan. Have a good day. Have a All good right, one. guys. Take care. Cheers. Yeah. All right, guys. That was it. Um, we did a little, you know, we did a little, uh, what's it called? Um, radio thing. And now... We talked to a few fans. I'm tired. I gotta eat, do something. Um, maybe I'll maybe I'll play you guys something. A little some some some. A little some some. Play a little some some some. Give me the itch. Those boys playing. Good job, by the way, guys. Too perfect, you don't need no filter. Go just make them drop dead, you a killer. Too perfect, you don't need no filter. Go just make them drop dead, you a killer. Shower you with all my intentions. Yeah, these are my only intentions. In the kitchen, cooking up, get your own bread. Heart full of equity, of an asset. Make sure that you don't need no mansions. Yeah, these are my only intentions. Shout out to your mom and dad for making you. Stand in ovation, they did a great job raising you. When I create, you're my muse. The kind of smile that makes the news. Can't nobody throw shade on your name in these streets. So we'll throw you a boss, you will pay you a beast. You make it easy to choose. You got a mean touch, you can't refuse. No, I can't refuse it. Picture perfect, you don't need no filter. Go just make them drop dead, you a killer. Shower you with. All my intentions, yeah, these are my only intentions. In the kitchen, cooking up, cut your own bread. Heart full of equity, you're an asset. Make sure that you don't need no mansions. Yeah, these are my only intentions. Shout out to your mom and dad for making you. Standing ovation, they did a great job raising you. When I create, you're my muse. The kind of smile that makes the news. Can nobody throw shade on your name in these streets? To so throw you a boss, you a bear, you a beast. You make it easy to choose. You got a mean touch, you can't refuse. No, I can't refuse it. Picture perfect, you don't need no filter. Go just make them drop dead, you a killer. Shower you with. All my intentions, yeah, these are my only intentions. In the kitchen, cooking up, got your own bread. Heart full of equity, you're an asset. Make sure that you don't need no mansions. Yeah, these are my only intentions. Thank you, guys. Love you. Take care.